Today I am going to teach about the unit trigonometry. So here, trigonometry is a word derived from three Greek words. These are trio, gonia, metron. Trio means three. Gonia means angles. And metron means measurement. So trigonometry, three angles measurement. So this trigonometry unit discuss about the relation between angles and sides of a triangle. We know that there are three types of triangles according to angles. One acute angle triangle and second one right angle triangle and third one is obtuse angle triangle. Now in trigonometry we take right angle triangle. So this is right angle triangle. Right angle triangle means in three, three angles of a triangle, one of angle is 90 degrees. So here angle B is equal to 90 degrees. So totally the sum of three angles of a triangle is equal to 180. Angle A plus angle B plus angle C is equal to 180 degrees. So one of the angle in the triangle is 90 degrees. Then the sum of other two angles is equal to 90 degrees. So this is about right angle triangle. So in right angle triangle, the side which is opposite to the right angle is called hypotenuse. Hypotenuse. So in this triangle, opposite the side which is opposite to the right angle is called hypotenuse. Suppose if we take another angle theta at A then the side which is opposite to the angle theta is called opposite side. So here BC is opposite side. And this is adjacent side to the angle theta. So here AB is adjacent side. Okay. So in triangle ABC, it is a right angle triangle. The side which is opposite to right angle is called hypotenuse. And now let us take theta at A. BC is opposite to theta, the angle theta. So, this is called opposite side. So, here BC is opposite side. Next, the remaining side is called adjacent side to the theta. So, let us take another angle. BC. So, here right angle. So now let us take theta and C. So here it is hypotenuse. And this is hypotenuse. So here we take theta and C. So this is opposite side to the theta. So here AB is opposite side. Here AB is opposite side because the side which is opposite to the angle theta. The remaining side BC is called adjacent side. So in this figure we take theta at A. So this is opposite side and this is adjacent side. So second one. In second picture angle is at C. So this is AB is the opposite side and this is adjacent side. In each triangle hypothesis is same. Correct? Now we are going to discuss about trigonometric ratios.
So there are six trigonometric ratios in trigonometry. These are sin A, cos A, tangent A, cosecant A, secant A, contangent. Correct? First one, sin A. So we can write it as sin A. So the formula of sin A is opposite side by hypotenuse. Here in the triangle, we take theta at A. So this is opposite side and this is adjacent side. So according to theta, this is opposite side and this is adjacent side and this is hypotenuse. So in these ratios, the formula of sin A is Opposite side by adjacent side. Here opposite side is BC. By adjacent hypotenuse is AC. So formula of sin A is equals to opposite side by hypotenuse. Opposite side by hypotenuse. So here in the triangle opposite side is BC and hypotenuse is AC. Second, second ratio, cosine A. So in the short form, it is cos A. We form cosine A. Short form is cos A. So the formula of cos A is adjacent side by hypotenuse. Adjacent side by hypotenuse. See this triangle here. Adjacent side is AB. So here adjacent side is equals to AB. By hypotenuse is AC. So third one, third ratio is tangent A. In the short form, it is tan A. So observe, we take angle at A. So we write here tan A. If you take at C, you can write tan C. So third ratio is tangent A. The short form is tan A. So the formula of tan A is opposite side by adjacent side. Opposite side by adjacent side. In the triangle, what is opposite side? BC. So BC by adjacent side. A. So tan A formula is equals to opposite side by adjacent side. That means BC by AB. Next, fourth ratio. Cosecant A. We can shortly, it is cosec A. Cosecant A. So the formula is hypotenuse by opposite side. Hypotenuse by opposite side. Side. Here hypothesis is AC by opposite side BC. Opposite side is BC. Next, fifth ratio. Secant A. The formula is hypotenuse by adjacent side. Hypotenuse by adjacent side. Here what is hypotenuse? AC by an adjacent side is a, B. Next, last ratio. Cotangent A. Cotangent A. We can write in short form as cot A. Cot A. The formula is adjacent side by opposite side. Adjacent side by opposite side. What is it here adjacent side? AB. AB is adjacent side and BC is opposite side. So AB by BC. So here C sin A and cosecant A. Sin A formula is opposite side by hypotenuse. Cosecant A formula is hypotenuse by opposite side. Sin A formula is opposite side by hypotenuse and cosecant A formula is hypotenuse by opposite side. So both are reciprocals. So here we can write it as 
cosecant a is equals to 1 by sin a cosecant a is equals to 1 by sin that means cosecant a is reciprocal of sin next see second one cos a secant a so cos a formula is adjacent side by hypotenuse and secant formula is hypotenuse side by adjacent side. So these both are also reciprocal to each other. So second formula secant A is equals to 1 by cos A. So secant A is reciprocal of cos. Next third one. C last one. Tan A cot A. Tan A formula is opposite side by adjacent side. Tan A. Tan A formula is opposite side by adjacent side. And cot A formula is adjacent side by opposite side. So these two are also reciprocal. So here we can write cot A is equal to 1 by tan A. So cot A is reciprocal of tan A. So here we can observe cosecant A is equals to 1 by sin A. Secant A is equals to 1 by cos A. Cot A is equals to 1 by tan A. So from this we can write sin A into cosecant A is equals to 1. Sin A into cosecant A is equals to 1. From this we can write cos A into secant A is equals to 1. Cos A into secant A is equals to 1. Lastly, tan A into cot A is, is equal to 1. So we can use these formulas in any problems. Correct? These are the trigonometric ratios. Six ratios. One, sin A. Second one, cos A. Third one, tan A. Fourth one, cosecant A. Fifth one, secant A. And last one, cot A. Once again, sin A is equal to opposite side by hypotenuse. Cos A is equal to adjacent side by hypotenuse. Tan A is equal to opposite side by adjacent side. Cosecant A is equal to hypotenuse by opposite side. Secant A is equal to hypotenuse by adjacent side. And last one, cot A is equal to adjacent side by opposite side.